No need to worry, this guy was great. He took us to the town of Alba, where some bozo demanded our blue crystal for his red one. Yeah, sure dude, I, I guess. If a blue crystal makes you happy, then just take it. I mean, what's so special about these stupid ass crystals anyway? Then, it dawned on us. This town was full of ladies hitting on us. Seriously, look at this. Ooh, she wants to get to know us better. This lovely lady has been waiting for someone like us to come along for a long time. There's no question that our soulmate is living in this town, and tonight is the night we finally find her. Eh, not her though. Oh, thanks for the tip, my lady. We haven't felt this confident. We were pulling all the moves, all the stunts to show off how insanely awesome we are. It was finally time to make THE move by proposing with a beautiful, lavish, red crystal. Or should we say, propose? We got rejected by everyone. Yeah, I figured we tried talking in their mashed up translation error lingo, but uh, you know, that didn't work. <laughs> or it could be because Simon smells like a steaming pile of toad shit, you know, from never showering. <laughs> Get it? So we did what everyone would do in this situation. Spent all our money on something cool to make ourselves feel better and run far away to a quiet place to cry. There you were, on top of a cliff, weeping like a little baby boy in pain from all the rejections. We thought we were cool, man. How could you not? Like those, like those moves! Then out of f***ing nowhere, a tornado emerges and sweeps us off our feet. Something we weren't able to pull off with the ladies. And takes us to another mansion. What? You're damn right that was a horrible night. Wait, hold on. How did you guys even know how to do that? I mean, that's some of the most insane sh** to ever be in a video game. You two obviously cheated. Case closed. Frauds. Uh, let us explain. This is the infamous tornado trick. In order to get to the next part of the map, you have to select the red crystal, go on this cliff, and kneel down for a few seconds to spawn a tornado to warp you. That's just ludicrous! Honestly, how is anyone supposed to figure that out without looking up some sort of walkthrough? Yeah, sure there's a couple of hints. Why not just, ooh, I don't know, have us platform away up the mountain? Or actually, no, I got a better idea. The game might as well have us slide to the left, and then slide to the right, followed by two hops and then cha-cha real slow. How about you take old man Jones to the alleyway next to the church where we gotta go down real low and yawn the worm? Huh? Yeah, yeah, and then and then you gotta do a drug deal in the cemetery with the shady stranger. After that, you gotta do a line of coke with Cindy back at her place. Then you gotta take it back now. One hop this time, not two. And finally, you resolve your sins with the priest where he specifically tells you to kneel and pray at Deborah's cliff and wait for the Holy Spirit to pick you up and whisk you away to a better life. That sounds way better than reading a sh 